Okay, welcome, welcome, welcome. Must be a sneeze and order on our responsible individual interpretation regarding the readings. This is going to be an all sign reading. So she that fell on my motherfucking desk, y'all, dealing with a hood bitch who's using sex magic and genital candles to get some type of justice from some severed relationship. And it's going to be a powerful discovery on who this motherfucking mad bitch is, mad nigga is. Uh, nigga is an ignorant, mad, ignorant motherfucker that's doing sex magic. Um, they got some kind of, uh, some type of, uh, skin disease or something, some type of, I'm hearing cancer. Like somebody might have cancer, skin cancer or something like that from doing this sex magic. They was unprotected. Somebody slept with somebody that was unprotected. They was dirty. So it's a hood bitch out here that's unprotected. That does not have no title. That's into sex magic, genital candles, uh, kissing spells. Um, this person um, can even be in the poison ivy family. You know, poison ivy. Okay. Yeah, and this person is using sex magic, magic to get some type of justice. Um, they telling people they it's not witchcraft, it's sex magic. <laughs> if they have severed some relationships where people have walked away from this powerful person, this is a person in power, a person in power. This is going to be a powerful discovery on who this person is. Okay, so on the flip side of shit, you got a hood bitch. They get satisfied by a good friend. They have unprotected sex. This person is jealous of somebody. They tell somebody how they don't. I hear, how can I be jealous if X, Y, Z, blah, 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 blah. But then the person they telling this, this shit to is in love with the person they jealous with. And they know it. So they went to get genital candles to do some type of sex magic. Um... Someone wasn't clear or didn't set their boundaries with this person. Uh, and now justice is coming for that sex magic on somebody that wasn't a hood nigga that was not, uh, I, they said all the way hood. This, this person wasn't all the way hood, but they wasn't a nigga. They wasn't ignorant. They, either they left this, this tie, this community, this relationship, this friendship, this group. Stop. Go. Or... This group pulled away from them, realizing they was the mad, crazy motherfucker doing dumb shit for power and made a powerful discovery that the motherfucker was uh, down on their luck and lonely. So it's going to be a hood nigga here that's lonely and gets satisfied by this good friend. They can even get satisfied by somebody they really low-key jealous about. But somebody's falling in love and now somebody want to set some boundaries. So... It's a hood, bitch. They say if somebody lives by the hood or in the hood. Hold on one second. Okay, yeah. So somebody could have been definitely here. Uh, somebody that's not hood need to set some boundaries. Uh, somebody didn't. Somebody aimed at blocking somebody's money. Showing disrespect to this person. And they expected good luck. But they didn't went motherfucking crazy because some is complete with this person being lonely. So somebody getting justice for either the hood, the hood bitch or the non-hood nigga. Take the energies how they resonate. If it's a feminine energy, male energy, I know how it go. Okay, somebody want justice saying it's not witchcraft, it's sex magic. Uh, broke up their relationship. Somebody should have set boundaries. Somebody aimed to go after somebody's money. Could be the bloodline of poison ivy, um, some type of sex magic with genital candles. Somebody must sell them, and they get satisfied by a good friend. Could be a tray of a tray with a hood bitch doing the sex magic. Mm, 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 mm. And look on the back of the damn deck. Somebody who they dealing with like to whip it out. They like to. <laughs> and this is a secret enemy. And this, and, and this dick don't put him to sleep. 
somebody want to use, uh, want some connections with mending somebody's heart, somebody wants gifts, uh, somebody want to take a family business on or something like that, manifesting with sex candles. This person broke up, might be going through a breakup, a divorce, or manifesting a divorce, a breakup. Somebody don't do not want do not want to reconcile with someone, or they don't want them reconciling with someone that could be their one, because they know this person is going to express their love. I hear gratitude. Some ritual they was doing failed. Their foundation is now broken. This person is not an air sign or does not have air in their chart. This person shows balance. Could be a Sagittarius. It's getting tarot readings on on somebody. Yeah. And look, just 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 to show you, somebody dedicated to the honeymoon. They dedicated to this sex magic, trying to manifest the honeymoon. Somebody is not free in they cell. <laughs> Somebody wants some obstacles clear so they don't go to jail. Somebody manifesting getting some damn head. They gonna whip it out. They gonna see if their manifestation work. Motherfuckers is crazy and simple-minded as hell. Look at this shit. They avoiding their obstacles. They feel like if they clear out this obstacle and whip it out for somebody to get some head, they'll avoid them from going to jail. Somebody get restrained because they did not have a gift. Or they wasn't a gift to a motherfucker. Yeah, this could be the main female dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius. 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 Mm mm mm. Could be a, a, a Aquarius with Sag in their chart, or a Sagittarius with Aquarius in their chart, and they coming through on this main female. Whoever been abusing their power on this privileged person in secret. Could be a Leo is weak and paranoid about that, by abusing their power. Being weak and paranoid and secret about abusing their power on a privileged person. Who could be the main female with Sag or Aquarius in their chart? Dealing with an uh, uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius. They found out this person wasn't gifted and somebody had to be restrained. Probably the Aries Leo Sagittarius had to restrain themselves or or get restrained because they didn't have some type of gift to clear their obstacles or to keep their ass out of jail. Mm, mm, mm. They keep showing me this deck. So let's go ahead and get into this. We ain't spent enough time talking. All right, give me something for the hood, bitch, that's unprotected, having unprotected sex. Uh... <laughs> the spirit. Spirit say kisses in unexplained places. <laughs> oh my God. Give me some for the hood, bitch. Getting pleasure by a good friend. Yeah, somebody put him up to it. I hear somebody put him up to it, but they didn't tell him follow. Somebody rushing in because they put him up to it. Somebody want to see something. If I cut the deck, yeah, something's happening fast. Super fast with these two. Oh, what card is this? Yeah, somebody coming back. So a hood bitch that would have unprotected sex getting uh, fulfilled by somebody out of jealousy or out of jealousy, somebody falling in love. They get satisfied by a friend, a hood bitch, who got pushed up to do this. Give me something for the sex magic. So, uh, shh, the sex magic and sex candles. All signs. Look at this. Yeah, somebody is sad about they sex uh, magic or they enchanted kiss or whatever the fuck they was doing with them damn candles. Somebody set boundaries and blocked somebody off. Somebody was knew somebody was taking aim at somebody. Somebody blocked somebody off. They, they hurt right now from they cut ties. They want justice for their lost relationships. That was an unwished fulfillment. And I say uh, Sagittarius. So it is definitely an Aquarius here. That wasn't fulfilled with some type of justice that has cut ties with somebody. <clears throat> and that could be the nine hood nigga that didn't cut ties or people that walked away from them because they wasn't the wish fulfillment. And now someone is in the nine of cups in reverse, uncontent, lonely. Somebody can, somebody is on the ball head, on the ball head right now. Uncontent and lonely. Yep. This could be a person doing work or at the job with this. 
they can work together with the two of wands. Somebody's not seeing this person work or what they do for work. Yeah, somebody is not healed. Starting confusions, feeling stuck. When somebody can't betray somebody. So, somebody, look at this shit. Somebody out here doing spells, they whip it out to see if it's working. Because they didn't put so much time and work into that damn thing to clear them obstacles for somebody to avoid jail. And spirits say it's the truth. If it's true that somebody's trying to avoid jail by clearing obstacles, by doing some type of work, spell, sex magic, and they're going to whip it out and see if it works. Mm -mm -mm. Give me something for the hood, bitch. Getting satisfied for our good friend. Once they come back, unprotected um, sex. Blew the fuck out. Yeah, out in the open. Something's going to be out in the open with this hood, bitch. Getting kisses in unexplained places. <clears throat> sex magic. Genital candles. Yeah, no one forced them to do this. They took it upon themselves to do this. Um... Somebody felt like it was high honor or in good honor that they separate from these people or these people separate from them. Um, this Aquarius is not wish fulfilled with some type of justice that's held in high honor. So it's uh, not Sagittarius, goddammit, uh, Aquarius, see? You gotta be an Aquarius with Sag in a chart or a Sagittarius with Aquarius in a chart. But however, it's not a wish fulfillment that this person get justice held in the most high. People are leaving from this person or this Aquarius is leaving from th this situation. A agreeing to disagree in the situation to move forward. Yeah, because it's judgment. Look at that shit. It's judgment coming out here. Because they uncontent. They run around bald head, uncontent. Look, struggling to move forward, hands tied. Give me something for this lonely motherfucker, uncontent, running around bald head. Came out quick. Because they toxic. Could be dealing with a Capricorn. It's uncontent, running around like a mad motherfucker, lonely. Okay. Yeah, feeling like something is an injustice in the situation. It could have been somebody left away from these people because they weren't protected. Uh-uh, hush. Okay. Somebody was sad and uncontent when somebody came back because they wasn't a wish fulfillment. Some was telling her honor that some come out and nobody don't. Oh, so this toxic person wanted to be held in high honor when something came out without them forcing it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody going to take an L from moving too fast, moving forward, uncontent of their uh, feelings or agendas. Somebody in their feelings. Leo could be on the road and not in denial about them trying to clear their obstacles to stay out of jail. Doing work, manifesting, doing manifestation work. Sex magic rituals to see if it works. Somebody going to try to whip it out on your ass, the Lord. Spirit say it's the motherfucking truth because this motherfucker fell left out after they couldn't defeat you. And look, justice coming over there. You got justice coming. Justice, two justice and the judge, goddammit. And somebody can see this person is running out of places to go. They're getting hot everywhere they go. Ass on fire. Give me some for the hermit. In reverse, some coming out with the hood bitch being unprotected or having unprotected by a real good friend that's coming back. All signs. Good bitch. This person probably don't have no kids. Or probably got rid of a kid with God being here. Yeah, change. Somebody could have changed God or something like that. Somebody in the marriage didn't believe in God. Yeah, somebody in the marriage believed in God and somebody didn't. Hold on one second. Hold on. Okay, give me some of these sex, magic, and candles. Motherfuckers testing their manifestation out and sad as fuck. What's the eight of swords? Sex, magic, and the five of... Is that the five of swords? Five of cups. What's the five of cups? Why is the eight of swords in reverse with the... 
with the five of cups in the upright with sex magic in the upright. Yeah, the main female. So this person, this little bitch wanted to be the main female to say that they didn't push somebody's hands. Yeah, that's because they're doing sex magic, so they're not going to badger or push somebody about, do this, do this for me, and this, this, that, we need to do this. No, they're going to do it through sex magic rituals, genital candles, okay, and it's going to fail. Somebody here is the real privileged person, probably with kids, have a family. Let me sign for this relationships breaking up. Either they pulled away or the relationship pulled away. Some was unfulfilled with an Aquarius. Aquarius was unfulfilled that some held in high honor to get some type of justice within the household. So some justice is coming to some household. Somebody in the household saying it's not witchcraft, it's sex magic. Somebody is really off they shit right now. And the most high said that it's not going to be a wish fulfillment. Dealing with a wealthy man and a family, family unit. Give me something for the mad, mad man or woman, lonely out here, uncontent and toxic. Mad, lonely and toxic. <laughs> mad, lonely and toxic. Somebody ain't received the, the fine print. Somebody didn't read the fine print that this motherfucker was lonely. Uncontent, mad, and toxic. <laughs> mad, content, mad, uncontent, and toxic. Trying to anchor some shit down. Yeah, this could be happening right fucking now. And a loyal person could be watching this shit. Okay, hold on. So, somebody doing manifestation spells. They probably gonna whip it out on you. They could be doing that shit at the job, and you look over like, what? Somebody could work in a cubicle <coughs> with somebody's evil stepmama, who is vengeful, sabotageable with the Aries Leo, Sagittarius being in reverse, the Queen of Wands in reverse. <coughs> this stepmother could be trying to be vengeful and sabotage. Hold on, vengeful and sabotageable to a, a high priest, a priestess who has walked away or left. Left, left, a, left a scene or left something behind. Wait a minute. Left something behind. Hold on, y'all. Okay, y'all. My bad. I'm bad. Okay, so yeah, somebody was definitely. Uh, there's a stepmother that's an Aries Leo Sagittarius that's vengeful, sabotageable, working with her friends, trying to think on the next move they're getting ready to make against the. Queen of Pentacles, something unbalanced, dealing with a Sagittarius, uh, a Virgo, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It could be the friends that this evil stepmother is working with to try to sabotage a high priestess who has left. It could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn that has left, and that is a high priestess. Okay. I don't know how that goes. Okay. Yeah, because obstacles not clear when they trying to anchor down something and somebody sees what they trying to anchor down or hold down to, to some obstacle is clear. Mm -mm. And spirits say that's the truth because this motherfucker felt left out because they couldn't defeat somebody and justice is on that ass. So justice is coming for somebody. Ooh. Let me get all signs. So there could be a main female that's not the biological parent of a child. They got some false documents from a house. I'm here in an old house. Yeah, consistency. This person is constantly waiting on something, on a servant. So some somebody in the house could be constantly waiting on somebody, like neck and pull, like a servant, a slave. Mm -mm. Somebody could have a chain around somebody's neck. Like, like back in the old days, somebody was really off their shit here. Give me something for a child coming out of a hermit mode, dealing with a hood bitch. Yeah, something went in, dealing with a child. Uh, somebody shit was not selling. Somebody got a, a fake letter. <laughs> So don't even wait for this fake ass document. That's what it's saying. Cause whatever they selling ain't real. Whatever they offering ain't real. Give me 
something for the safe magic. Give me something for the safe magic. It's this main female in despair about. Yeah. Thoughts about how much money they spent with this priestess. They feel like it's not a misfortune. Yeah, but they get some type of message. They get some type of message about how this dark priestess don't want to do service with them no more. And they think, they telling them, well, I spent all this money with you and I didn't get the service I want. This is what they telling the high priest, the priestess of night. Let me some for, they said somebody getting the justice, people pulling away from this person, or you, your person to watch it could have pulled away from this person. Yeah. And something is not surprising when it comes to a house or someone that is not hood. It's not surprising to them that this person wants justice. It's going to be held in high honor, and that Aquarius is against it. And Aquarius has pulled away from people, or people have pulled away from the Aquarius because whatever was going on was held in high honor that this person get justice. Aquarius still saying that it's not witchcraft, it's sex magic. If somebody is doing that in the house, and somebody is not surprised, not surprised, they're not surprised this person don't have no gifts, they're not surprised they're going to send a, a letter to a priest. A priest have added up already how much they didn't spend with them, and they feel like they keep going to this same priest or priestess, and they ain't getting no results, and they thinking about all the fucking money they didn't spend, and some won't end. Give me something for these fake documents for somebody uncontent and lonely and toxic. Toxic, uncontent, and lonely. Yeah, won't be no reunion. They won't, won't be no reunion because now they're dealing with the devil. Somebody does this work in the basement of their house. This is somebody's wife as well. Somebody uh, was in the uh, military, got a medical uh, discharge. Yeah, this person likes to console with the angels to keep somebody faithful. Yeah, this young this young woman in reverse, this is an older woman who's in sorrow and avoiding prison. And somebody not waiting for prison to come to them. They in so much sorrow. This older woman is consulting with the angels, hoping somebody be faithful, trying to spread joy because they don't want people to know they pleasure seeking with the sex magic. Mm. Okay, so they somebody can see that this motherfucker is pleasure seeking on the low. They being too giddy gee with a motherfucker trying to clear their obstacle to anchor some shit down with somebody that's not their divine feminine dealing with the main male. So the main male could be dealing with somebody that's not their divine feminine trying to lock it down. They ain't getting no message of concern about this person having obstacles, but some is restrained here due to an Aries Leo Sagittarius who is abusing their power with the magician in reverse with a weak ass Leo who is doing work on a high priestess who has moved or has mo is moving, could be a Virgo towards Capricorn, that's dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius that's sabotageable, vengeful, step stepmother, step figure, whatever, with their friends, with a Gemini Libra Aquarius being one of the friends of Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and a Sagittarius. Damn. All right, y'all, this is what I got for what the fuck fell out on my desk, the random shit. All right, peace, love, likes, I'm out.